What's going on ladies and gentlemen, Rizzle from Rizzle Vapes here, coming at you today with uh, something different. We have a mech mod. Now, I think I said in previous uh, videos that I do not trust these devices, and uh, I guess things change. So today, what I thought we would do on this, in this episode of... Unbox mod is what I want to call this uh, series where we go through the unboxing of the mod and uh, You know have a little fun with it. I would be uh, doing this the stingray X clone was sent to me from a buddy of mine here in town uh, Just to kind of fill with and uh, nobody else wanted it at the shop. It was the last one so came to your boy so yeah let's dive down and uh, let's unbox the stingray alright guys so here it is the box for the stingray we pop the top off here and boom there's the unboxing now I'm just kidding so in there right away first you'll see the mod so we'll go ahead and pull that out you can see it says Stingray right here. It's got some sick engravings. Now the only place I've been able to find these online are Fast Tech or eBay. I mean, I don't know the quality of the eBay ones or the Fast Tech ones, but this one is pretty solid. So now when we unscrew the top here, you'll notice that there is a 510 connector in here. And it's not spring loaded, but it, it is uh, movable. So I always just put my atomizer on first and then you can see where it protrudes out and then you can attach it back to the device when the battery is in it. Now, let's uh, set that there. Now these things do come apart into several different pieces so you can use a different variety of batteries all the way down to this small little guy. Here's your fire switch. You can pull that out. To show you how easy it is to take the thing apart. All right, and there's that. That's a spring, obviously, spring loaded. Firing, firing pin. This is your lock ring. Uh, I'm just gonna leave that on. It can come off, but uh, I'm just gonna leave it on and then there it is I mean that is that's the device like how simple is that so to put it back together you'd obviously we could start by taking the firing switch just going in here and screw that bad boy all the way in and actually we'll uh, we'll bring it out a little bit It's a little clicky on the firing switch. It's all right though. And you take a second piece, just screw it back in here. Take your third one, screw it back on, and then you can take your pin and throw it back on. However, I'm not going to do that yet because uh, I wanted to show you guys this piece basically makes your mod a hybrid mechanical mod. So your atomizer would connect directly to your battery. Um. I'm told that hybrid mechanical mods uh, have less voltage drop and are just really good, but uh, you know, this is my first mech mod and mech mods kind of sketched me out a lot prior to picking this one up, so I'm just going to leave the standard 510 on there. And inside the package also comes with a drip tip, stainless steel. It's a pretty nice little drip tip. So. To complete the device, all we would have to do is, I don't, I mean, you don't have to unscrew, oops, I don't want to unscrew that one. You don't have to unscrew these, I don't believe, but I just like it. I'm going to pop this out a little ways, about yay. You take your 18650, put it in like so, you take this like so. 
Go ahead and screw that on top here. That's no bueno. Like so. Pull that off. Move the locking mechanism. Move this till it sits tight and then fire it. And we're firing. Let's go back up top and vape it. Just hits great. I love this thing, man. I picked this up yesterday from the shop owner and I haven't put it down. I haven't touched my other box mods or anything yet today. I'm just, I'm just loving this thing, man. Anyway, guys, that was the unboxing for the Stingray. I'll leave a couple links down to where you can get them online. Pretty cool device, pretty sweet little clone. And uh, yeah, if you liked the video, go ahead and leave a like, comment down below, subscribe to stay up to date on all my latest content. I will see you in the next one.